morning and welcome to Children's Chapel. I'm Pastor Tiffania. And I'm Ms. Becca, and we're so glad you're with us. We're here at Seminole Heights United Methodist Church, and today is a special Sunday. It is Palm Sunday. We are celebrating God's love for us and praising God together today. So let's go ahead and get started with some singing and dancing. You can stand up and sing and dance along with us. Good job singing and dancing. So now we're going to listen to a Bible story. So I want you all to put on your listening ears and we're going to put on quiet voices and we're going to listen to this story about Palm Sunday. The story of Easter, the triumphal entry. This is Jesus, hey who is the son of God and the savior of the world. While Jesus was on earth, he taught everyone about God's love and healed people from their sickness. He did many miracles like calming storms and even raised people from the dead. At this time, the Jewish people were celebrating a festival called Passover that had been celebrated since the time of Moses, when God brought his people out of Egypt. So Jesus was going to Jerusalem to celebrate. Jesus and his disciples stopped in the town. You're coming? And Jesus told two of his disciples to go on ahead of them. Eh, okay. He told them to go into a village and that they would see a young donkey that no one had ever ridden. Rock! He told them to untie it and bring it to him. If anyone asks, what are you doing? He told them to just say, the Lord needs it and we'll return it soon. Okay, go ahead. So the disciples did what Jesus said and brought him the donkey. A long time ago, before Jesus was even born, God had said that the Savior, the King of Israel, would come to Israel in this way. And now Jesus was doing just as God had said. The news that Jesus was coming to Jerusalem swept through the city. Many heard about all the amazing things he had done, so they cut palm branches and ran to see him. Huh? The Pharisees and religious rulers realized that there was nothing they could do, for everyone was going to see Jesus. Jesus rode into the city of Jerusalem and the crowd spread their coats on the road ahead of him. His followers began to shout and sing as they walked along, praising God for all the wonderful miracles they had seen. The Pharisees were upset. Hey, Jesus! And they told Jesus to stop the people from saying things like that. But Jesus said, if they keep quiet, the stones along the road would burst into cheers. So the people kept on singing, blessings on the king who comes in the name of the Lord. Praise God in highest heaven. 
the entire city of Jerusalem was in an uproar as he entered, asking, Who is this? And the crowds replied, It's Jesus. And Jesus rode the donkey through the street of Jerusalem to the temple in a triumphal entry, just as God said he would many years before. Okay, so in our story, we learned about how Jesus entered the city on a donkey and everybody was laying their garments in front of him and waving palm branches and shouting Hosanna. And in the church, we call this Palm Sunday. We celebrate this Sunday the week before Easter and we do it as a way to praise God for his love and everything he's given to us. And so sometimes in churches, you'll see people waving palm branches on this Sunday as a way to praise God. Because that's what, in our story, in the Bible, that's what the people were doing. So the week before Easter, we try to remember that. And you know what? This Sunday, Palm Sunday, actually marks the start of what's called Holy Week. It's the week leading up to when Jesus died on the cross and then rose again. And it's how we celebrate Easter, because you know what? Easter's not just about hunting eggs that the Easter bunny has left. It's actually about celebrating Jesus' sacrifice and love for us. And so Palm Sunday is the start of that week when we remember what Jesus did and how he loved. Okay, so we're going to sing a couple more songs. So I want you guys to stretch out your dance moves. Get up and get ready. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Praise ye the Lord. Praise ye.
So clap your hands and wave your arms. Play the drums and then rock the guitar. Great job singing and dancing. It is so fun to praise God and worship, right? Well, we are going to pray together before we go. So can you guys put your hands together and close your eyes and repeat after me? Dear God, thank you for your love. And thank you for the gift of Jesus. Help me to share your love with my words and my actions. I pray for my family, my friends, my church, and my neighborhood. In Jesus' name, amen. You all have done such a great job today. Thank you for joining us for our Children's Chapel. Next week, we're going to worship together on Easter Sunday. Uh, we'll have a great celebration here in person and online at 1030 during worship. And we'll have a special Children's Chapel at 930 for our Easter celebration. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.